before we start, I didn't think it was the best music video. It's like, obviously, like, the song is fantastic, you know, shit like that. Best music video, I don't know. <clears throat> Definitely most hype music video, but, um, best music video. My guess he did say so far this year. Did he say that? Let me, let me go back. Kendrick Lamar just dropped the best music video this year, yeah, and honestly- okay. Credit this year, okay. Uh, to be fair, I haven't seen a better one yet. Okay. See, all that can be said is that he is on the top of the hip-hop world. Mean. After the pop-out concert, it really felt like there was nothing else that Kendrick Lamar could do. But here, Kendrick Lamar is again reminding people why he is the boogeyman of hip-hop. And without further ado, let's just talk about everything that's happened so far. The last chapter of the Kendrick Lamar and Drake beef was not too long ago. With the pop out Ken and Friends concert reminding people that Kendrick Lamar is like that. He pulled out a bunch of West Coast legends and just overall West Coast stars. And not only did he show the importance of unity and community, he showed just how petty he can be. He opened up the <laughs> really show did. with Euphoria and closed it with Not Like Us. Not once, not twice, not five times, but six times. All the while paying tribute to Tupac and having like 30 people on stage dancing while he did straight which by the way didn't just include rappers it also included people like damar DeRozan and russell westbrook and given how much of a groupie drake is for basketball players i know that had to hurt and not only was he dissing drake with words he was doing the little hotline bling dance and all of that is to say that kendrick was on one that he night and he has been ever since like that drop for reference as to how good kendrick lamar is doing like that is still in the top 15 of the billboard hot 100 euphoria is still in the top 50 and not like us since in the top three drake by the way has one song in the top 100 and it's the one where he raps over the bbl drizzy beat so go figure in other words kendrick lamar already won the beat and honestly he didn't need to drop a music video but he did shortly after the pop out concert rumors of a not like us music video being shot started circling around and on independence day july 4th of 2024 kendrick lamar has decided to drop the not like us music video oh, which reminds me if you july hear fireworks at all during this video it's because of that it's because kendrick lamar decided you know what july 4th people are having a good day let me just drop some heat on them like i'm not complaining but at the same time he's kind of he's kind of rude for that you know what i mean but with the stage being said let's talk about that like that video because i have some thoughts about it because kendrick lamar starts the video hot teasing a song for what might be his next album life goes on i need her my baby and honestly i would not be surprised if some people thought that kendrick lamar wanted to drop another one another diss track just for the lols but but for now it seems yeah, like it's real. unrelated we will keep an eye on it but for now the video cuts to this guy knocking on the door years. to the rhythm of what's called shave and a haircut which I didn't know how to name, but now I do. Which apparently dates back to a minstrel song. So anyways, the guy is greeted by Tommy the Clown who asked, what's the password? And of course, the password is... I and I mean, is there a better way to start off a video? I don't know. I personally never have. But that doesn't mean you shouldn't subscribe to this channel. Because oh, honestly, damn. I would appreciate Gross it. Uh, trying to hit 41k now. Anyways, let's get back to the video because Tommy the Clown is teaching a class full of students how good of a song Not Like Us is. It's also not lost on me that this could be another reference to Drake being a pedophile. But yeah, of course, in that class is none other than Mr. Morale himself, Kendrick Lamar. With a very interesting attire, if you ask me, to be honest. But is doing his little dances and stuff and then he just had to do it to him and of course he had to do it to drake he drops and he he, he does some push-ups of course referencing drake's first response with push-up back when drake was talking about dropping give me 50 and honestly i think push-ups was good but i don't think it even matters anymore <laughs> And I feel like most shots in this video is just Kendrick Lamar proving why he won. But we'll talk about that later. Of course, he's doing push-ups on cinder blocks, which I assume could be a reference to jail. Like, I don't know, cinder block push-ups just kind of looks like something someone in prison would do. Especially with the plain bed and frame. It just, I feel like it's a reference. But of course, that's followed by probably the funniest part of this music video, which is Kendrick Lamar smashing an OV Ho pinata. And here's me thinking that this video was just going to be a simple oh i'm in compton type thing and no it's pretty creative especially when kendrick 
Kumar does the hot scotch dance, which again is probably a minor diss at Drake for being a you know what. Certified pedophile. And then it cuts to a crowd full of people talking about they not like a. And honestly, this gotta be a sad day for Canada. Cause to see the most notable Canadian of all Pretty time shambles. get cooked like this on 4th of July, it just it just has to sting. They not like us. They not like us. They not like us. It's very similar to when Kendrick did the same thing yeah, for King Kenta, well, yeah, which yeah. of course we now know is partly directed at Drake. So of course I find it a bit funny. Then Kendrick walks into this local restaurant to diss Drake again, which might be a reference to New Ho King and how Drake doesn't show love in Toronto like that. But speaking of Toronto, what is DJ Mustard doing with a Toronto Blue Jays hat on? Like come on dog like come on and while we're on the topic of toronto sports teams domar the rosen pulls back up and at this point man he just doesn't fuck with drake like i don't know something must have happened between them two because they used to be they used to be buddy buddy his nickname is comp 10 for a reason so maybe it's just him repping content more than anything all of this is happening while kendrick lamar is dancing in a suit doing his best wall street impersonation i guess they have this girl dancing on the rope but i don't know how they did it but shout out to her yeah, she's really great. hitting that <laughs> anyways a little further up in the music video they show a shot of kendrick posted up with the whole crew that's punch that's top dog that's musa that's j-rock absol and schoolboy q which is in the same location where king kunta was shot at and it's all smiles and it's dancing and whatnot and then we get the most definite blow of the music video because for the past month month and a half i was yeah, thinking already, man you know? kendrick lamar really didn't need to address the the white beating allegation which to me in the moment was the most damning thing against kendrick and at least to me made me feel like it was a little bit even but at the end of the day there's yeah. no reason why I come out and say yo i didn't beat my wife when you can just dance with your whole family on drake's grave the family matter and the truth for the matter he was god's plan to show y'all the liar when not really only shutting down shit. the whole kendrick you beat your wife narrative but also shutting down the narrative of kendrick your kid isn't yours even though he looks just like you <laughs> and as kendrick says it is god's plan to show y'all the liar and you almost have to wonder if he wrote this bar with this shot in mind or if it just oh, came shit, to be how it was away. but let's just say Maybe drake and yeah. drake fans are looking bad because even before the video dropped they were trying to get ahead of it by saying it doesn't look like whitney wants to be there but she looks like she's having the time of her life so i don't know man, man. family to matters me, to me just doesn't hit the same now it doesn't plant that seed of doubt in my head like it used to and with the recent flop from drake and camila cabello i just gotta say that it's looking tough for drake it's, it's going to be a long summer full of whops ov hoes and a minors and honestly thinking back to the beginning of the beef and the beef as it happened it's kind of hard to think about the time where it did look even where you could look at the yeah, beef and real. say hey it's 50 50 right now because now this is one of the most lopsided beatings in hip-hop history and i love how the music video ends because the music video ends with kendrick lamar putting an it. owl in a cage implying what we all know them ov ho peoples need to get locked yeah, up locked man away. and video side man it's looking bad for drake like i honestly would not be surprised if this is the beginning of the end for his like prime or his career as a whole and honestly drake, i'm not bro. saying he won't be famous because very clearly drake will be famous forever but it might be time for him to do that ice cube switch he into acting up the cape. or i guess switch again back into acting but the music hey, side is looking bad and personally i like to keep it real but if there's one thing i've learned is that in storytelling sometimes it's more important to show than to tell or in other words sometimes you gotta pop out and show niggas and kendrick <laughs> lamar showed out they really did anyways all right so this one was kendrick lamar is a genius he truly is, bro. Kendrick really, like, I don't know, like, Drake, he, he overkilled him, bro. I think, I think he's cooked. And Drake don't look like he's even coming back from it at all. So I don't know. I, I don't know what to say. There's not much left for him uh, to do, bro. All he can do is sit back and just, like, wait for the summer to be over, I guess, and have a good winter. I, 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 don't, I don't know. Drake, bro, you seen the video, bro. He, he's done. Drake said it himself. He did.